The Great American Brass Band Festival is a unique festival, one of the top brass band festivals in the world. We bring renowned artists from all over the world to our little community and show them a piece of Americana here in Danville, Kentucky. In some ways, uh, small town America represents the best opportunity for the arts to come together, uh, for there to be a real sense of unity. City of Danville, Boyle County, Center College, where, where I work, uh, have a long reputation for caring about the arts, both the visual and performing arts, to promote them, to do, try to honor and, and pay tribute to the men and women who make art, who do art, and who value it. Teaching at Center and being a member of the community, uh, I've seen how things work together, I know. Uh, I was involved in the, in the beginning of the Arts Center uh, in downtown Danville originally, and uh, that was kind of a huge jump forward when, when that took place with the Arts Center and uh, its a pivotal role uh, and location in downtown Danville and the old post office. That's really been the hub, I think, of things. So there have been some real leaders and some tremendous artists over time that have caused Danville, Boyle County, and, and Center College to stand up tall as a place that values the arts, imagines that they, they make a difference for good in the lives of people, and in my case at Center College, in the lives of our students. And it's a significant part of their education. We have a, a strong cultural um, heritage here in Danville, and we have a lot, a lot of art um, through Center College, through our community artists, through the festivals we have here, through our um, performing artists, and so we've all come together. We want to show um, Kentucky and people outside of Kentucky what we have to offer. I've come from a school that, that believes a lot of people either do care about art or they would like to care about it. You know, it seems to almost start sometimes with a, a building. You know, there, there's a, a renovation of a building. Patrons in the arts uh, will, will take one of these old buildings and it becomes an art center, and then things seem to, to grow out from that. And being designated as, as one of these special communities, these inaugural communities that care about art, I think gives us a chance to announce boldly that we are that kind of place. Many people will come to, to Danville because of this designation um, to see these assets that we do have. We find that also with this designation, um, all of our entities have come together and we are working together to um, create something bigger than ourselves, and to create um, new events, new uh, partnerships, um, new grant opportunities, um, all sorts of things that, that we feel are going to bring people to our community and also um, bring the other cultural districts together so that we can um, promote Kentucky. <laughs> it affirms what we've done and at the same moment I believe challenges us and in fact inspires us uh, to continue that tradition and to build on it and that would be our plan at Center College. That is our plan in Danville and in Boyle County. I do take pride living in Danville with the Arts Center, our new library, but I think what's affected our community more than the tangible aspects or the intangible aspects, there, there's just a feel about living here that, that, that is new and is exciting and is progressing and I, I'm not even sure where it's going to go. I mean every every month or so, I'm, I'm surprised by the activities that are happening in our community. So I'm not sure where we're going to go, but it's definitely a, a movement that's going to continue and get stronger. We take nothing like that for granted, and we know that we are uh, feeling quite honored uh, to have been selected as one of the inaugural sites, and I uh, look forward to continuing to meet that obligation and that responsibility in the Commonwealth of Kentucky as a, a shining star, if you will, in promoting the arts. I am very proud of Danville and we feel very confident that things will continue to grow. Our, our entire community is going to use this designation um, as a promotion and we feel great about it. For folks who might have an interest in understanding better what we've accomplished and why we would be identified as one of those special communities, I invite you to come. Uh, call me, uh, call Stephen Powell, call some of our friends and colleagues in the city and in Boyle County and come and look and understand better what we do. We don't have any trade secrets uh, that we're intending to hold tight. Um, I believe that all boats, in fact, are lifted by a rising tide. 
So if there are other communities and cities and towns in Kentucky uh, that can meet the mark, that's good for all of us. That's good for each and every one of us.